you know, I want to talk about something very serious right now, and that is healthcare in this country. I just, I just got let off from my job, right? They're laying people off. They laid me off my job, and now I got my tooth hurts. And now it's like, well, you better decide. You better elect. It's just like, it, like I don't have to make these kind of choices. I don't have to. It's like, where are the insurance brokers to cut through all this? And to just, what do you, you know, what do you got? What do you do? Rough thing. Okay, this guy might have big health problems. He should take this insurance so he doesn't lose everything he has, right? But those don't really exist. You just got to learn. You just got to make a choice. Like, what do you want? A high premium? Do you want a low, low, uh, out of pocket? Do you want, you know, all you, 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 jargon? Yeah, so then it's time, it's time to go for Cobra. I got, look at you, you got to read your Cobra thing. You got to read your Cobra. Let's see, it's pa oh, page 8 of 11. Let's see, where, where was it? Page 1, do they do? Oh, here we go. Here we go. It's just like 13, 14 pages, double-sided. Okay? Sometimes double-sided things are fun. Ha uh, not this. From this company called Wex, right? And they're in charge of Cobra. So Cobra, their companies that just do Cobra. They just specialize in in make in in people paying for the insurance that the company was paying for right and everyone i had like everyone to yeah cobra's high oh cobra's high it's high well then well who the f is gonna do it like what is it yeah, that's high well then wh why are we talking about it why are we talking about it but yeah 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 you get this important information this packet contains important information about your cobra continuation coverage rights and other health a coverage alternative. This action summary, this, this 14 page action, double sided dildo action summary provides actions that may be required of you. We recommend retaining a copy. Please read the entire packet. Read it all before you make your coverage decision. S sit around like you're doing, uh, uh, like you're studying for like some fucking thesis for this. And, and this is the thing. I don't have to do this kind of, I don't have to become this kind of expert to decide what kind of groceries to buy. I got to think a little bit about it, but I don't really. I just go to the places, got cheapest, and it just takes me a couple minutes, and I buy it. I don't have to do this about uh, the, the, the internet. There's only so, there's four choices, three choices. How fast do you want it? I'll do this. This makes sense. Okay, I do that. You know, I don't have to become an expert about how it works. And with this health also, it's complicated as fuck, just understanding the health care. You, the choices you have to make, the decisions you have to make. As you get older, you're, if you're not older, you're going to find this out. It's, you, it's hard to make. You've you got you to gotta analyze systems and surgeries and medicines and all this kind of stuff, which is complicated enough. So all these other things, you know, like electricity, internet, food, uh, uh, you know, credit cards. Should I do the credit card? You know, but, 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 you know, and for a lot of these things, you have the taxes, you have people that'll help you. You give them some money and they cut through all this shit because they know it, but you don't really have that for healthcare. No, you don't. No, you don't. I found there was one, there was one at a place I used to go to a clinic. I used sliding scales thing. And, and I went and I was like, I want to meet this lady. And she just said a bunch of shit. I didn't understand a goddamn thing about it. Cause I have like this learning disability about this shit. I guess everyone else is just like, oh, you know, I just I thought about it. You know, I prefer a low overhead and a double undersided. Like, what? What? But no, this is what they do. They do this because they got they got you by the They got you by the whatever anatomy you have. <laughs> they have you by it because this is your body. And so they're just like, it just, it just, it, it just erupts and explodes in just like, just like a capitalist fucking orgy. And it's just like like administrative assistance to administrative assistance to people, but nobody to aggregate all this shit for you. And so you gotta be like, oh, talk to your friend so-and-so. Like maybe she, like, she might understand this. Oh, you guys are gonna help you figure out. At the company where I got insurance, where I was insured, like there were two and a half hour fucking meetings that you could attend just to try to figure out the healthcare options. And there weren't very many options. There was like two type of options and, and like, like one of them was just like, they, you get the help, the flexible savings account and you can have some money instead and just spend that instead of having the thing where you just pay monthly. Of course, yeah, you're getting health insurance from work, but you still got to pay it. Right. And then the Cobra thing is like, we're going to give it to you for the same your employers paying paid, but it's just, just all the other is, is just like, it, it, they're taking, it's $700 a month for Cobra to do the shit that it was doing before. I was trying to, when we, when we changed insurance people, when the company I was working for was bought by, uh, 
by another company. We, I, I was at Kaiser. I lost Kaiser. Kaiser is really the best insurance. I was really bummed. I started looking into it, how much it was going to cost for a person like me without a family plan to just pay for Kaiser. And it was $700 a month. And that was like a, two and a half years ago, two years ago. This is $700 a month. This is Cobra's expensive. <laughs> Fuck's sake, dude. Are you fucking kidding me? I mean, I understand. This is, but this is the death of us all. This is, I, oh, D, you're going, you're ranting. Oh, boy. Oh, you're going, you're going all crazy. You're angry, upset. Yeah, this is just being a grown up. D is time to adult. Mother this is, this is, our fucking, this is our fucking, this is our downfall, dude. This is the downfall. You're chilling. You got a house. You don't have a house. You're paying a lot. You're paying a lot of rent. You're doing whatever. You're making it work. And then you're going to have a fucking health problem. And if you didn't sign up for insurance, you're going to be fucked. If you didn't sign up for the right insurance, you're going to be fucked. Either way, you're going to have to do some fucking, um, turn your shit into a Jerry Lewis telephone on the internet with fucking GoFundMe and shit. Oh, my fucking leg is attacking my head. Oh, help me. I can't, you know, oh, fucking God bless the USA. I mean, I don't know how it is in other countries, but this is just, this is just, this is just not, it's nonsense. And it pisses me off. And you know what? One of the main reasons it pisses me off is because I, I'm expected to learn all this shit. Like, I'm supposed to be looking for a job. I'm supposed to be looking for a fucking job. And no, nope, I gotta just, you know, I gotta read that 14 page thing. We don't really have to read the 14 page thing. Give me a fucking break, dude. But it's fine. We accept it. It's the Wild Wild West. You know, there was a guy, there is a guy, and his name is Bernie Sanders. And I tell you, Bernie made me feel like there was hope. It could be a little different in this country. He talked about health care, pretty good amount. And, you know, it made me realize, because I was always accepted as a wild west in this country. You know, when you cut your fingertip off, you just fucking Google that shit. You hold tight, you keep the part you cut off. This is my own story. And then you go into the fucking pharmacy, or you go into the drugstore, excuse me, and you just, you know, look at their shit. And then you say, man, you talk to the pharmacy lady. And you go, man, man, hey, you know, the finger. And she, oh, I'm so, she goes, I'm sorry. Because it's like horrible, it's horrible. But it's, I'm, she's not going to tell me to go to a doctor. Uh, I can go to urgent care. What's that? Oh, I'll bet it's a company that exists to fill the gap. But people who know that 911 is a joke. If you call 911, the ambulance is going to cost you $2,000. And the emergency room visit is going to cost you $5,000. So they got urgent care. There's a private company. And they're gonna, <laughs> and they're gonna charge you, and and just <laughs> rape your life and destroy everything because you had an unfor you had the nerve to let an unfortunate thing happen to you, whatever it was. Oh man, you <laughs> up, dude, dog. No, <laughs> man. Oh, oh, you hurt yourself. Oh, I see. You're sort. You're at a disadvantage. You're at a disadvantage. Well, let us help you. <laughs> let us help you out. Oh, come right in. <laughs> Wait, fine. Yeah, there's a line of 45 people. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you.